a food service worker at the Detroit Tigers Stadium who was fired after video surfaced showing him spitting on a pizza, has been sentenced to 18 months of probation. 21-year-old Jalon Curley also was ordered Thursday to take an anger management class and to not work around food while he serves his probation. He earlier pleaded guilty to one felony count and one misdemeanor count of food law violations. The felony was punishable by up to four years behind bars. Curley didn't comment during Thursday's hearing. His lawyer, Carla Marable, says Curley was very remorseful. Officials determined that the video which was subsequently posted on Instagram was recorded on September 21 during the Tigers game against the Kansas City Royals at Comerica Park. The pizza was apparently intended for a customer. Tests later showed that Curley didn't have communicable diseases. Footage of the incident showed Curly spitting out a large string of saliva onto a pizza before he mixed it in with his sauce. After the clip went viral on social media, police investigated. The person who originally posted the video to Instagram, Quinnell May, claimed Curly was mad and having a bad day when he spat on the pizza, but also said he had done it in the past. Share this article share in the video caption, May described how he reported the video to management but was shut down and sent home. Every time I tried to talk, they told me to shut up, he said. MEY claimed he was threatened with prosecution if he didn't take the video down. Detroit Sports Service, the stadium's food provider released a statement claiming the company immediately closed that food stand and disposed of all the product after the video surfaced. As soon as we became aware through social media of potential food tampering, we immediately closed that food stand and disposed of all the product, it read. Food safety is our top priority and we will take any appropriate action necessary to protect our guests. One Tigers fan, John Schiffinator, had a particularly bleak reaction to the video saying, The unfortunate part is, it's not uncommon. People don't realize how many different places do things like that.